In this video, I'll show you how to connect your HP LaserJet M209DWE or any other LaserJet that are looking just like this one with your Windows PC computer. This way, you'll be able to print via Wi-Fi without connecting any cable between these two devices. So let's get started right away. Over here, where you see the control panel, first thing you need to do is to press this I button during about four seconds. So keep it pressed, one, two, three, four, then release it. Next step is to press this Wi-Fi button, it's very small over here, at the same time as this X button. You just need to press them once, like this, don't need to hold them. Then this Wi-Fi uh, light will flash and on the front over here, you see, this light should turn to purple. If the light does not turn to purple after you did this, just press the small Wi-Fi button once again. And wait. And the printer will make a noise, this is normal. And the light will turn to purple after about 15 to 20 seconds, just be patient. You'll go into the Windows Store of your PC and you need to type HP Smart because you need to download this app to make both work, uh, work together. So this is the app you need to download, HP Smart by HP Inc. Download it. Now we are on the main screen. You may have a big add new printer button here. You need to click on it. But if you don't see it, like in my case, go over here on the left side and you see this icon with a printer and a plus sign, click on it once. It will search for a printer and it should just appear in a few seconds. Give it uh, some time. It's searching. And here we go. We have a list of all the printers that are ready to be paired. And ours is the first one, HP M209 LaserJet. Click on Setup. Then click on Continue. Then from this screen, you're going to press No Tanks. And you're going to enter the Wi-Fi password of your Wi-Fi network. Make sure that this is the name of your network here. This is mine from my uh, home network. So I'll just go ahead and type my password. And when you're done, press connect. Now it will ask you to press the I button uh, located on the control panel of your printer. Let me show you where it is. It's right over here. Press it once and the setup will continue on the computer. Okay, when this is done, you're gonna have the green check mark and you're gonna press the continue button. Here we have a screen just telling you if you want to share your personal data with HP. I always encourage you to, I always tell people to not do it because it's your personal data and uh, just click on manage option here and then make sure that every single of them are unchecked and press continue. Then you're gonna select the language you want uh, the interface to be in, in English and your country, press continue. Okay, now HP will try to sell you their HP Smart, HP Plus, how they call it, service. I'm not saying it's a bad service, it's just that you better not accept it now until you know uh, in what you're getting into. So they will present their uh, the features of this service. And now it's a bit sketchy, I will tell you why. Because here you can press learn more and it'll give you more information about it, about this HP Plus service that costs uh, monthly. It's like a subscription service. Or you can press continue, okay? Because you don't have any other options. So many people will press continue and then hear what they say. By confirming, you agree to, f you agree to the following requirements connect your printer to the internet. So you'll have to make sure that this printer is connected nonstop to the internet and also 
use only original HP toner, buy HP cartridge or enroll in instant ink. This is very bad because you won't be able to use any third party cartridges, which are usually five times cheaper than the HP. So if you press the confirm, confirm button, literally your printer won't work with anything other than HP cartridges. So my advice is to not enroll in this service. Again, it's up to you. Maybe you're fine with this. Maybe you're gonna buy anyway HP toners and cartridges and you don't mind this, then go ahead. But for many people, this doesn't make any financial um, sense. So what you need to do is to exit setup because your printer is already connected to your Windows PC. They don't tell you here because look, I'm gonna press exit setup and then it will tell you, it will warn you, setup incomplete, printer won't work until setup is finished. Don't worry, the setup is finished. They just want to scare you to give, so you go and choose their service. Press exit setup, and I'll just show you how both of these still work. So exit setup. Okay, so now we're back on the main screen and here you see finished setup, it tells you it shows like you need to finish the setup to make it work, but that's not true. You don't have to finish the setup. What you need to do is to press on print documents and I'll show you that it still works. Here press OK. Select the document you want to print. Let's say I want to print this PDF, press print. And now on the top here, make sure that under printer you see HP LaserJet M2 09 DW. In my case, it says copy one. If I click, there's another one right under. So if it doesn't work with one of them, just switch to the next one and it will work. So make sure that these options are okay. So the paper size, the output quality, numbers of copy. And when you're ready, just press print and the printer will print the document. Just wait, make sure you have some paper here. And here we go, we have the document. So yeah, HP is trying you to enroll you in their program and make, uh, make you believe that you absolutely need to finish the setup, but when in fact you can use your printer without doing this and without accepting those limitations I talked about previously. And by the way, you don't have to go in this HP app every time you want to print a document. So let's say I'm over here, I want to print any document that is on my desktop or any other folders, just open the document, the PDF, press the print icon. This will open, make sure that your printer is selected here and press print. So we have one page here, that's another page, because that's, yeah, it even prints on both sides because I selected this. Anyway, you see you don't need to go in the app if you want to use uh, your printer. So this is it, this is how you connect your PC computer to your HP LaserJet M209DWE printer. I hope this tutorial was useful, if so please leave a like subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Also, leave a comment down below. I'm trying to read them all. I can't guarantee I will, but uh, yeah, thanks.